Let's start with the executive order that ended a key Obamacare subsidy. Donna? Yes, yes. So President Obama and the Republicans have been saying for years that Obamacare was going to implode. Uh, two executive orders recently may uh, speed along that process, possibly. He signed one executive order that ends the subsidies to insurance companies. Um, what, they, what these subsidies do is they are intended to help make health insurance cheaper for people. Um, but it is a big, big amount of money. And a lot of people have already said that Obama uh, was acting beyond his constitutional authority to um, institute the subsidies and appropriate... A federal court ruled that. Yes, yes. Um, to appropriate that amount of money anyway for the, um, for the subsidies. But what's happening now is the two senators, a Democrat and a Republican, Murray and Alexander, have come up with a deal that they say will save the subsidies and also give states a little more flexibility in how they implement and what regulations they take on from Obamacare. Initially, yeah, Trump, Trump he, said he, he would support he it now. That. Yeah, he he's endorsed it. Off. He said he was on board. Um, now he's saying it's a bailout, um, and there are a lot of Republicans that are saying it's a bailout um, of the insurance companies. And so now we're not really sure how they're going to move forward. What's the fix? Are they going to chip away at it? Um, are they going to save the subsidies? It's going to be an interesting thing, but we're down to a deadline. Open enrollment is November 1st.